Hey, welcome back. This time I'm coming to you from my classroom instead of my shop because I have an experiment for you. I got this old vacuum pump working and I have a vacuum chamber to go with it. So we're gonna take a look at wood glue under a vacuum and see what happens. So what I thought I'd do to make this as clear as possible is I'm taking this pickle jar, turning it upside down, and in this concave area, I'm gonna put in some wood glue. Here we go. You can see there must be a lot of dissolved air inside of that wood glue to produce so many bubbles. I was really surprised when I first tried this that there was so much air in the glue. I'll leave a clip at the end of the video where I showed the kids this at the end of the school day. They really liked it too. They thought it was pretty cool. Got a good reaction from them. Okay, I'm going to turn the pump off now. And you can see and probably hear as soon as I turn that off and it starts to let some pressure back in because it's not a perfect seal, the bubbles drop. And all that, that gas that expanded contracted again. It doesn't feel any different than normal glue. I'm not sure exactly why it has so much air in it though. Let me put some fresh glue on this one and compare the difference. See if I notice a difference in consistency. It's making a mess here, but yeah, I do feel a difference. It seems like it definitely feels like this has been, uh, it's a little thicker. It feels like it's not as thin, uh, like it have greater viscosity than right out of the bottle. All right, so a quick experiment there for you. I'm gonna clean up now. I made a little bit of a mess. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit a thumbs up and hit subscribe. Also, I have a science channel where I'm gonna be putting more stuff, vacuum chamber experiments and things like that on there. So check that out. That's called Brainstem, and I'll leave a, a link over here for that. Until next time, take care and go out and make something. Have you been on a project? That would be way too much. Turn it on. Do you know if something's actually going to happen? No, I don't. Oh, this is that air pocket. I see some bubbles. Trying to there. suck the air out. Whoa. Oh! That is cool. I want to just put your hand on YouTube. Wait, what would happen if you put your hand in there? I don't want to eat that. Would it like. You'd have to chop off your hand first. Yeah, because. Well, it's under the vacuum, so it apparently has a lot of air suspended in the glue. And that's what's coming out when that happens. It does. All right, you guys can go. Have a good day. Bye, YouTube. <laughs> that is so cool. Is that all it does or will it do more? That's it. Yeah, that's it. It looks like all the, all the air that was suspended in it's coming out. Neat. So would it be more sticky?
right when you turn it on, there was a tiny bubble there that you could see. And then it just, I could see it raised a little bit, then pop the next thing I saw with two more bubbles for it, and then that started. See ya. Have a good day. You too.